it's not about who got more talent than the next motherfucker. Man, there's some trash ass rappers out here in, in, in this motherfucking city sometimes, you know. But the thing is, though, if them niggas invest behind themselves to put themselves in position, my nigga, that's what counts. They making sure that they get heard. I know I was one of the motherfuckers like, nigga, I'm one of the only R&B niggas that's on the list. Trey 600, 3600, 3600, 3600, 3600, 3600. And I would say, why I got you here, man, we, we, we talk about it sometimes offline, but yeah. how, how you feel about the list, man, that dropped this year? You was on it last year, yeah. you know what I'm saying? We got, it was a whole lot of new people. How, how you feel about the Austin scene? But let's just get about, let's talk about the list real quick. All right, I'm gonna I'm I'm just say this off the rip. Man, it come, when it comes to the list, man, I, I hate when people get butt hurt about the list. See, in my opinion, it don't matter where I'm placed at, you know what I'm saying, as long as, you know what I'm saying, I'm getting heard. A lot of people, they don't understand that, like, if you're not getting heard, that means you just ain't putting that groundwork. It's not about who got more talent than the next motherfucker. Man, there's some trash ass rappers out here in, in, in this motherfucking city sometimes, you know. But the thing is, though, if them niggas invest behind themselves to put themselves in position, my nigga, that's what counts. They making sure that they get heard. I know I was one of the motherfuckers like, nigga, I'm one of the only R&B niggas that's on the list. You feel me? I can rap like a motherfucker too, but that's some shit that I showcase here and there. Right. But like, you gotta invest behind yourself. Niggas a pay to play game. And niggas, they, they wanna sit in their goddamn car all day, make little bullshit ass, little TikToks and thrillers and thinking that they supposed to be the next popping shit. Nigga, niggas ain't even got their paperwork together. Niggas ain't got a damn simple ass DBA, a tax ID, no none of that shit. But niggas talking about some, oh, they the ones that's making noise in the city. This ain't no shade towards nobody. I'm just telling niggas straight up, get your paperwork together, man. It's a 90% 90, 90 goddamn big business, 10% music. It's not about your talent, nigga. It's about the groundwork, the paperwork, my nigga. You got to stamp that. You feel me? Then you're going to be on that list. Then you can pop your shit. Then you can worry about where you're trying to place yourself. Now, nigga, in my mind, this is how I look at it. I feel like, Trey Six, I feel like you scatter people all over that bitch in general. But that's gonna make a nigga work harder, man. I exactly. wanna be number one. Guess what? When you number one on that motherfucker, that means you just undeniable. You undeniable, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? And in my mind, my nigga, like, shit, I feel like shit, I accomplished a lot of motherfucking shit coming from where I come from, nigga. I come exactly. from, from nothing. I got it about the mud. I ain't I ain't got no street team, it's just me and my manager. Right. So for, for for me to just invest behind myself, nigga, I spend twenty thousand over here, another ten thousand over there. Shit, I'm putting myself in position. And that's what I feel about the list. Niggas need to put themselves in position, then pop your shit.